We're still talking capacity building. Participants at the Incubator Nigeria Future Clan Bootcamp in Redemption City, Ogun State, have agreed that digital empowerment and training are essential tools to address youth unemployment and social unrest in the country. This consensus highlights the growing recognition of the importance of equipment young Nigerians with the digital skills they need to thrive in the increasingly digital economy. Details in this report. This program is significant for addressing poverty and promoting economic growth in Nigeria by providing digital skills to young people. With over 12,000 applicants, 5,000 assessments and 1,000 selected for in-person meetings, the initiative targets individuals aged 15 to 45 to prepare them for the future job market. Pastor Oluag Bimileke Adibui emphasized the goal of empowering Nigerian youth to start businesses and boost the economy. Uh, this is the first. We are hoping to do more, hopefully next year. We are hoping that in nine months, the people that have come will be able to give birth to good businesses and um, be able to start their own, uh, their own uh, companies and things along that line, but with the mindset that they will come back to support. Now, if everybody is able to create job and create wealth, that would elevate poverty as a ripple effect across our great nation, Nigeria. Because if one person is doing okay in a the family, they'll be able to support other people and that ripple effect will continue. That individual too will come out of school, have a job and be able to help that community. So that's part of what we are hoping to do and aiming to do, especially in this uh, amazing economy that we are in right now. I believe strongly that this, in a way, will help our youth, about a thousand of them or more, to become uh, people that will participate actively in the fourth industrial revolution. Uh, like we all know that um, Africa and the third world, we missed out on the first industrial revolution, the second and the third. So what we're doing is to make sure that we level up uh, in terms of enabling our youth uh, to be more active and viable in participating in the fourth industrial revolution. So uh, gaining the right skills, which is uh, paramount to that, is what we're doing for them here, and um, which is the basic you know, uh, level when it comes to the basic entry point into the fourth industrial revolution. So, and uh, we believe that you know, quite a number of them will start from here, we learn, get jobs, gather experience, uh, start their own companies, you know, and then contribute better to the economy of Nigeria. Present education we have doesn't connect with the reality of the future. The future is in the future is in the digital. Now, every six months, new things are being are coming up. What you learned about six months ago become irrelevant. And when you check all our curriculums, they never connect with reality, with progress. They never address the uh, today problem or the problems, I mean, loaded problems that we have. Now, and so we are taking it upon ourselves to see that the young one, they are equipped for the future, not just people in the church, but people in Nigeria and in Africa. RCCG's Continent Trees Digital Transformation Drive aims to boost the Nigerian economy by equipping young Nigerians with digital skills to address unemployment and poverty. Instead of employing them directly, the charge empowers them to start their own businesses and create job opportunities. Yano Fatai Williams, Executive Director, African Missions Global, emphasized the societal impact of this initiative highlighting how it enables more people to benefit from the program and integrate their digital skills into different sectors. We believe that with this initiative we can, we can reach a large number of youth, at least a million a year, on this. And you know that when you skill up young people with digital, the digital knowledge, they can do anything. They can do anything in any sector that appeals to them based on their digital skills. So the digital skill makes it different. So a young person who wants to apply his, his or her digital skills in music, in drama, in the food industry, in education, in healthcare, in aviation, engineering space, will be able to do so riding on what digital technology has to offer. In this one week, I've actually learned that there's so much that I didn't know, that there's so much things that 
cyber security is such a broad aspect of the tech industry. And so I've learned that there's so much more you can learn by digging in and learning and paying attention to people. There was other things like soft skills, how to relate with people, job interviews, how you are nailing those kind of things, how you meet people, how you relate with new people you meet. And there was also the God aspect, the spiritual part of, of being a human being. So I think it's been more than just tech. The RCCG Digital Skills Initiative aims to earn spiritual, economic and social progress for Nigerian youth by providing them with digital skills, as this will reduce poverty and foster economic growth in the country. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.